Solid-state batteries, also known as solid electrolyte batteries, have been available for a few years, but they're still in their infancy. For a long time, we've been told that the technology will be available in passenger vehicles starting in the early 2020s. We finally received our first clear commitment that this will happen in 2021, and it came from Toyota. Hello guys, welcome to another exciting video from eMotion. In today's video, we'll tell you everything you need to know about Toyota's new solid-state battery. But before we go any further, please subscribe to our channel and enable notifications so you never miss a video from us. Now without further ado, let's begin. The Japanese manufacturer, which has long mastered the hybrid sector but has been relatively quiet in all electric things, says it will unveil a functional prototype next year, followed by a production model, according to the Nikkei News Agency. This invention heralds the dawn of a new era for electric automobiles. Solid-state batteries are smaller and safer than standard lithium-ion batteries, recharge faster and have a better energy density. They employ a solid electrolyte rather than the liquid or gel polymer electrolyte used in lithium-ion batteries, so they take up less physical space to produce the same amount of energy and are less likely to catch fire if damaged. It's a win-win situation for whoever can be the first to market with solid-state batteries, and the advantages don't stop there. It's estimated that a car outfitted with this technology might have a range of 1,000 kilometers and recharged in as little as 10 minutes. To be sure, those are game-changing figures. Furthermore, because electrolyte batteries degrade less over time, Toyota anticipates that they will retain 90% of their performance over a 30-year lifespan. The Japanese company has already filed over 1,000 patents related to this technique. As you can anticipate, there's still a lot of kinks to work out. The manufacture of this type of battery remains difficult. They must be produced under extremely dry conditions because the raw lithium required is a precious resource. According to Nikkei, the Japanese government aims to spend a portion of a new $19.2 billion decarbonization fund to build up electrolyte cell production facilities in the country to help expedite the development of this technology. The businesses preparing to create solid electrolytes include Mitsui Kanzuko, Idomitsu Kosan, and Shimotomo Chemical. Volkswagen wants to manufacture its own solid-state batteries by 2025, and Nissan plans to launch a prototype with this technology in 2028. Toyota is developing its battery in collaboration with Panasonic, a market leader. Toyota had planned to make some sort of announcement during the Tokyo Olympics last summer, but the coronavirus put a stop to that. It appears that 2021 will be the appropriate year for the first presentation of a concept using the new battery technology. This is a story we'll continue to monitor closely because 1,000 kilometers of range and a charging time of 10 minutes may be enough to soften the opposition of many hardened EV skeptics in the coming years. It's an exciting time in the automotive business, and Toyota has a slew of new innovations on the way that will bring a plethora of zero emissions driving options. We are at the forefront of battery technology development, with over 20 years of battery knowledge gained by working on our self-charging hybrid electric batteries. You may have heard about solid-state battery electric vehicles, which will be the next great game-changer for sustainable driving and in which we have been working for several years alongside our hybrid electric range. What exactly is a solid-state? So what exactly is solid-state battery technology? As the name implies, a solid-state battery is made up of solid electrolytes rather than liquid electrolytes. Our prototype batteries are approximately the size and thickness of a thin spiral-bound notepad. Solid-state battery technology has the potential to eliminate the limitations associated with electric vehicles that use conventional lithium-ion batteries such as the relatively short distance traveled on a single charge in charging times. Solid-state batteries are poised to become a viable alternative to lithium-ion batteries and we're concentrating on employing a sulfur-based electrolyte in our prototypes since it allows for more efficient power transfer. They would reduce the risk of fires and increase energy density which is how much energy a battery can deliver in relation to its weight. Next-generation batteries, such as solid-state and metal-air batteries, are both safer and perform better than lithium-ion batteries. Toyota and Solid-State Toyota is at the forefront of developing the first practical mass-produced solid-state battery, and by the mid-2020s, we hope to be the first company to sell an electric vehicle equipped with a solid-state battery. We've been working on this since 2012, with over 200 highly decorated and competent engineers working around the clock to create these batteries, and it's starting to pay off, as we now hold over 1,000 solid-state battery patents more than any other automaker. What does this imply for drivers? So, what does this mean from the perspective of the end user? A single charge allows for a 700-kilometer journey. It takes about 10 to 15 minutes to recharge from zero to full. All with just minor safety issues, Toyota's solid-state battery promises to be a game-changer not only for electric vehicles but for the entire industry. 
Under the same conditions, the electric vehicles under development will have a range that's more than twice that of a vehicle powered by a traditional lithium-ion battery. All of this is accomplished without sacrificing interior space and even the smallest vehicle. What comes next? Toyota is developing the solid-state batteries through Prime Planet Energy and Solutions Inc., a joint venture with Panasonic that began operations in April 2020 and currently employs approximately 5,100 people, including 2,400 at a Chinese subsidiary. We are on a pace to begin limited production in 2025 and look forward to sharing additional information when the time comes. Toyota has intimated that solid-state batteries will be used in hybrid vehicles before being introduced to EVs. The innovative battery technology will be used in manufacturing cars starting around 2025, according to the business. A solid-state battery replaces the liquid electrolyte solution used in lithium-ion batteries with a solid electrolyte. 1. The advantages of solid-state batteries include faster charging and less heat generation. 2. Toyota has created a prototype to test battery technology. 3. The Toyota Hilux will be introduced in India next year. Toyota's solid-state battery strategy Hybrids will continue to play an important role in Toyota's electrification strategy, and powertrain manager Thibault Paquet explained the benefits of solid-state technology, which include faster charging, faster discharging, and lower heat generation to our sister newspaper, Autocar UK. We can test and assess the technology under those conditions, he added, implying that the technology will be perfected in less EV-intensive hybrid applications before making its way to EVs. With this action, Toyota is reaffirming its commitment to hybrid technology in the coming years. According to European boss Matt Harrison, Toyota and Lexus will achieve a 70% electrified sales mix in Western Europe this year, and hybrid powertrains continue to attract new customers for both brands, especially those looking for practical and accessible ways to reduce their carbon footprint. Gerald Kilman, Toyota's European R&D leader, stated that Toyota will begin selling cars using solid-state batteries around the middle of the decade with the intention of giving greater output, longer range, and quicker charging periods. He stated that a working prototype vehicle outfitted with the technology was developed last year for testing purposes and that there is a continuing development program focused on durability. We feel solid-state batteries have a lot of potential for battery electric vehicles, he says. Toyota is teasing its next-generation hybrid system as it introduces an updated Gen 5 powertrain in its new Corolla Cross SUV, providing increased economy and performance thanks to small mechanical changes over the existing system used by the CHR, Corolla, Highlander, RAV4, and Yaris. Toyota anticipates that all of its battery electric vehicles will benefit from its varied battery strategies as it strives to leverage modern lithium-ion and solid-state technology to raise efficiency by 30% while lowering battery costs by the same amount in the near future. The corporation hopes that future developments will increase efficiency and reduce cost by half by the second half of 2020s. This could be critical for the introduction of low-cost mass-market battery electric vehicles. Toyota, on the other hand, is hedging its bets, as it always does. Despite the significant investment in battery electric vehicles, Toyota still expects the majority of its global fleet to be HEVs by 2030, with roughly one-third of that fleet being battery electric vehicles. It's unclear what the mix will be in particular areas, but you can expect China and Europe to offer more battery electric vehicles, while emerging markets will receive a stronger hybrid electric vehicle mix. It's unclear how much of total manufacturing will be electrified versus traditional internal combustion engine powered. And despite its recent battery electric vehicle push, Toyota clearly believes in its overall HEV strategy. It claims that the 18.1 million HEVs it has sold globally since the first Prius debuted have the same overall CO2 reduction impact as 5.5 million EVs while using the battery components required to construct 260,000 battery electric vehicles. That is to say, using these small batteries wisely has a significant influence. Toyota, on the other hand, is hardly an unbiased spectator, and perhaps the company's shift to battery electric vehicles is telling. The strategy's fruits will be seen in the 2023 Toyota B74X, a battery electric SUV that rides in the company's ETNGA platform and is the first of 15 battery electric vehicles that Toyota has committed to bringing to the market by 2025. On that topic, let's conclude today's video. Please leave your opinions in the comment section. If you enjoyed watching the video, please like, share, and subscribe to the channel for more interesting content and up-to-date information. We hope to see you in more videos in the future.